The Anglican Church of Southern Africa is proud, indeed honored, to recognize one of our own and to confer postmortally the Archbishop's Award for Peace with Justice on Oliver Reginald Tambo. Honoring the ANC's longest serving president, but the Archbishop was particularly perturbed by acts of looting and corruption around PPEs, which he reiterated that it was genocidal. We are living in a moment when public trust is at its lowest, as President Ramaphosa has considered. Whether it is around the theft of food meant for children, the failure to provide affordable public transport, or the grabbing of farms from of farms from poor people by well-connected government elites. He also sought to draw moral and ethical differences between leaders such as Tambo and the current crop of ANC leaders. He lambasted their failure to listen and respond with humility to the demands of the poor. Let us hear the pain and desperation of the poor especially of young Africans without jobs or hope who yearn for the social economic lives of our nations to bend towards equality, equity, redress, inclusion, redistribution, recognition, and real transformation, what I refer to as the new struggle. The Archbishop's pleas come at a time when the ANC is embroiled in a massive corruption scandal related to PPEs. Meanwhile, other churches under the South African Council of Churches and several civil society groups are calling for the arrest of those who are involved in corrupt practices. Manilis Tubase, SABC News, Parliament.